So I just thought about this trick. I'm sure when we do this Glo 3D um blender, Glo 3D blender to mix more animation, we kind of looks loose texturing for the character by the time we um export as alembic and import it to Glo 3D loose texture of this particular character. So I thought of this. So after doing the whole animation thing, which is my animation is ready, then I probably want to render, uh, want to export this thing back to LMB and uh, import it on your Blender. So I thought about this thing. So let's do like this, uh, export to LMB Gogawa. Yes. Um, let's see, we are doing like this. Uh, okay. And you are done with all this without avatar. Just make sure you are going to um, export without avatar. Then you press OK. I already have my design ready. And don't forget also to do the UV editor. Make sure your UV editor is on one box, not scattered like this. So uh, this is it. Make sure it's like this before you um, export. So the next thing you do is to uh, open my blend. So this is my character before exporting it to exporting it as Alembic, then importing it on Clue 3D for Clue animation. And by the time I um, import my character on Clue 3D, it was it came with or it was um, imported with no texture like this. But then I don't want to animate it like this. So what I will do is what I'll probably do is um file and since it is since it is the same animation that is on blender that is also on Clo 3d but the difference is that the one on Clo 3d has texture has no texture sorry and the one on blender has texture so what i will do is to just place the cloth animation on this particular character and the body flow with the close simulation will match up together since it's the same animation I use for the cross simulation on the 3D. I don't know if you get what I'm trying to say. But then this is what I will do. All I will do is to import um Alembic. Yes. Um, import Alembic. So guy animation. Yes. This is what I will do. Yes. So I feel this is perfect. Then I will just we can play it to check. But then this is going to just be perfect because this is exactly the same animation, the same character, the same height. So I don't know what you think about this, but I think this is actually okay. For people that want to give it a try. If you have any with you want to texture the character, so this is it. And the next thing I'll do is to place um texture on this particular character so let's do it i'm sorry on the cloth so i'm going to shade in yes so um uh, this is it yeah this is it so uh let's go to layout back so i think there's some error with my ev editor or ev editing placement that's why this place is to be black so but it doesn't matter so what what matter is what i'm trying to explain so um let's do something here first okay, okay. yes so the next thing I'll do is to let me just use HR environment texture open uh, my download. Uh, yep. Yes. Yeah. Let's be nice. So this is it. 
So I don't know what you think about this, but I think you can also try this in your technique in animation too. So, um, 